Hi everyone, this is Ben Songroth and this is part two of using Equatio inside of Google Docs. Now you have the ability to use your mobile device to insert math. It's really, really cool. So down here you can see the sixth option in the bar is Equatio Mobile. So I actually have, I'm gonna click that and when you do that, you can see you have all the different compatibilities here with either Android or your iOS devices and you get a QR code. So I actually have my phone up here and mirrored so what we're gonna do is we're gonna put this to the test. I'm gonna select my camera on my iPhone. I'm gonna scan the QR code. You can see I get the drop down there. I'm gonna open that up. And now it's gonna take me to my active math document. So I'm in math example right now. There's math example there. I'm gonna select it. Very good. The first time you might have to sign into your Google account so it knows who you are. And here we are. So there's a couple different ways you can insert your math. Down at the bottom here, you can draw your math out. So I'll try that one first. Select that, I found that turning the phone landscape gives me a little bit bigger canvas with which to work. So I'm gonna go ahead now and draw my math. And then when I'm done, I hit the checkbox, save as math. That looks like the formula that I want. So I'm gonna spin this back the other way so you can then now see how easy it is to insert it into the dock. I hit this big blue button down in the bottom right hand corner and off it goes. Just like that, I didn't fast forward or anything, it just automatically dropped my equation into my Google Doc. Pretty cool stuff, but gets better. So I'm gonna go ahead in my Google Doc and return down another line. I'm gonna bring my phone back up and then the speech works just the same as it does on the computer, so I'm not gonna demo that again, but I am gonna show you the camera feature because this is really cool. So I have a math equation written out, or actually this is the Pythagorean theorem written out again. I'm gonna select camera give it access, and then now you can see here is my equation. I'm gonna take a picture, and I will crop out the spot that I want, and I hit the checkbox again, save as math, make sure it looks good, looks good to me. Hit the blue button again, and off it goes. So, multiple different ways to have your students send their math into their Google Doc. And then when they're done with this, they could obviously use Google Classroom to turn it in or any other way that you're collecting Google Docs. So Equatio, a really cool, very user-friendly tool from TextHelp. Uh, I encourage you math teachers and science teachers to go and check it out. Thanks for watching. Follow me on Twitter at Mr. Underscore Sangroth and look forward to the next YouTube video that I'll be putting out soon.